and welcome back to the channel this video we're going to do the much anticipated speed test on the Lyric Graffiti it's foggy out we have a fog advisory so uh, we'll see how this is going to go I'm going to get out there to where I want to do the test and hopefully I won't have a problem we're sitting at 28 degrees as I do this speed test this morning. As I say, there is a fog advisory. I don't want to... Uh, if it's too bad where I'm going here, I may not do it. We'll see. Definitely cold on the face. I do have glasses on, but uh, to prevent my eyes from watering, because when you get going that fast, you get, with it's being this cold outside, your eyes are gonna water for sure. It does look very foggy, but. And definitely uh, on the cold side riding this morning, I can sure feel it. 28, it might be, even be a little bit less than that. My, even my glasses are fogging up so cold. Of course, we're now gonna, I, I pumped it up there to level five so we can get it going pretty good because when we go to do this, we want it to be... ...fast, of course. So many people want to see this, including myself. I want to see what the bike will really do. But look at how foggy it is. Out. Not the best time to do it, but I want to do it. I want to do it. And I want to do it in the morning before the traffic gets too much. And this is my day off to do it. My face already feels frozen. Sure is chilly this morning. Oh. Getting up here to the road I want to do the speed test on here. I don't want to do it in the... I do not want to do it in the uh, bike lane. For the simple fact that There's always too much debris in the bike lane. I'm going to go in the bike lane now, but I, I'm not going to go extremely fast because, like I say, I can't trust the bike lane. I think one thing I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to stop for a second and take my glasses off because they're fogging up so much they're hindering my sight more than the fog is. So let me take those off, put those in my pocket. I know my eyes are going to water but it's alright. So here we go. I'm going to get 
there's a street light going to be coming up here. And once I get past that, that's where the bike lane ends on this road. But then I'll do the test. So we're just going to try out and out top speed. And this is obviously, as I am right now, in off-road mode. We know what on-road mode is going to do. It's going to be 20 miles an hour. I mean, it may go to 21 or something, but right around 20. Just coasting down that hill, I'm at 29, 28. It is foggy, but I think I can uh, do this test. And I know I mentioned this over and over again, but this is an awesome bike. So smooth the ride very fast I'm not sure what we're going to hit but I I know we're going to I'm pretty sure we're going to hit at least that 38 that they say the bike can go all right here we go let's see what we get I'm running into a bit of a wind. Oh, well, we're getting 33 or 34. We're not getting no 38. And do a quick Yui and go back the other way. I don't know if that wind, a little bit of wind, was hampering me from going faster. It did not. Uh, the fastest I seen was 36, and that was going down a slight hill.
So the top speed I saw was 37. And it tends to get more on the flat that I saw mid 30s, maybe 34. And I'm in level nine. So it would be interesting to see this bike up side by side against a Grizzly in a race. So the highest I got it up to was 37 and on the flat looks like 34-ish. So if you'd like to leave a comment in the comments below, maybe there's a setting I need to change to make it go faster. That's the fastest speed I got out of it. And like I say, if you want to leave a comment in the comments below, go ahead and uh, let me know what you think or suggestions on making it go faster without changing any controllers and all. I mean, with just the settings within the bike. Because um, some one person claimed they had theirs up to 45 miles an hour and uh, can't see that. So that's going to do it for this video. If you would uh, like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, hit the subscribe. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, hit that notification bell. And as my mouth uh, freezes up, I can barely move it. Um, if you'd like to purchase this bike, I do have a link in the description below. And there is a code discount code to get uh, $100 off and that code is Oregon eBiker mark all one word it sure has a lot more takeoff for sure on level 9 I can say that but I don't see the 45 miles an hour that the one person was claiming and it did touch 37 miles per hour but that was going on a slight downhill and but it was consistently around 34 it could go around 33 34 miles an hour all right so that's going to do it for this video on the speed test of the Lyric Graffiti in the off-road mode. So once again, thank you for joining me today on this video.
as we cruise around we don't want to get off the bike so until next time take care